going on y'all what's happening you know what today i've been watching a lot of videos on people with the rolling 303 i didn't watch videos on how people say it's is this and is that right but hey i've been having this for 20 years so i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all what's happening how i go about using this thing all right, so let's go ahead and start it off with this drum beat. Now, this is one of the presets that was on the drum machine. And the good thing about it is that you can take the presets and you can copy the presets to a user, a user pattern. And then you can manipulate it the way you want. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to put some extra stuff in it. All right, here we go. Now, I got it on channel four. And how the MC work, MC303 works is for each part, you have to go up and hit part select, then you hit number four, then you can go to the cutoff. And then you can change it up and hit the resonance. And while you at it, go ahead and add some other parts. And once again, you can go to the part select, hit like I'm on number two right now, and I can take the cutoff. You see how I did that little cutoff? Hold on, check this out. And mute. You know what I mean? And uh, something else about this is that remember, you can go to your drum, to your drum parts and change up the drum sounds. See what I'm saying? All right, so y'all hear that going. Now let me go ahead and hit part select on the drums. Let's see what's happening. All right, let's see what we can do. And right now, I just got the drum beat going. I'm gonna go ahead and try to switch it up to number six. And I'm just, I'm just changing up the drum sounds. Let me see if I can change up that drum beat for a second. Hold on. Let me do something right away.
right. So y'all see, that's how it goes. Now, I'ma go ahead and show y'all something right quick. They got this deal, it's called, hold on a second. All right, let me take out some of that echo. The deal is that you can take the drum beats and send the drum beats out. 